we have a really special event happening this year and it's called a total lunar eclipse. The Earth has two different shadows. It has a penumbra, which is much wider, and then an umbra, which is a nice dark region. A full total eclipse is when that full moon is covered by that full umbra shadow. Well, let's take a look at that right here. This bright light will be our sun in this demonstration, and this is shined directly at our globe, which is on the other side of our demonstration prep room. Usually, that moon is not actually passing through the umbra of the Earth's shadows. However, in this case, it's actually going to be right in that full shadow. And it's going to take about four hours for it to pass from the start and coming all the way through to the other side. And during that time, you're going to see it kind of slowly disappear. And when that full eclipse happens, it's actually going to appear that blood red color from the atmospheric effects of our own Earth atmosphere. That light that does still illuminate the moon is actually a refraction of the light from around the Earth. So we see this almost sunset colored moon right there in front of us in the sky. The total lunar eclipse is a fascinating event, and it's best viewed with just your own eyes or perhaps a pair of binoculars. But if you're interested in seeing other things in the sky, we have an excellent facility here at Rutgers that's open to the public. This is the Robert Schommer Observatory. We're on the fourth floor of the Physics and Astronomy Building on the Bush campus of Rutgers University. This telescope has a 20-inch diameter mirror that collects the light then another mirror that takes that light and reflects it and sends it down to the eyepiece at the bottom of the telescope. You can see fainter and smaller things than you can with your eye. Look at the planets, see the rings of Saturn, the moons of Jupiter, glowing clouds of gas in the sky, nebulae. People are still fascinated with uh, the sky and still look up today because it tells us you know, where we live and where we fit in the universe.